Well, it was a historic occasion at the White House. The former President Barack Obama and Michelle Obama returned to 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue for the unveiling of their official portraits. Natasha Brown has more on this very special moment. The Obamas arrived to a huge welcome at the White House. Invited by President Biden and the First Lady for the unveiling of their official portraits. When future generations walk these halls and look up at these portraits. I hope they get a better, honest sense of who Michelle and I were. The ceremony was also a coming home for the former first couple. The former president has only visited the White House on one other occasion since the end of his administration in 2017. For Mrs. Obama, it was the first time back. What we are seeing is a reminder that there's a place for everyone in this country. That is what this country is about. The Obamas chose their artists, Robert McCurdy and Sharon Sprung, both portraits painted entirely from photographs. You'll note that he refused to hide any of my gray hairs, <laughs> refused my request to make my ears smaller. He also talked me out of wearing a tan suit, by the way. <laughs> A pair of earlier portraits were unveiled in 2018 and installed in the Smithsonian's National Portrait Gallery. These newer artworks will live here in the White House, a reminder of the Obama's chapter in the American story. Well, the artwork was painted from photographs taken in different locations inside the White House. Yuki and Jessica, back to you. Well, very well done. Yeah. Very well done. All right, Natasha, thank you.